Hi everybody and welcome to the Menagerie Mix Finals um, in which we are playing against Furco. Um, this is the first board. He's gonna be starting here and there's a lot going on here. We even got mouse as tracker. Um, which is not the most exciting mouse, well, but I mean, it's also not bad. We can maybe use it to top deck stuff, which um, would be a good thing probably. And we've got gold for trashing, also got bounty hunter, oh, and we've got pouch because it's a mouse. Oh, that's cool. So next hand is gonna be double, double two. Um, so you could open three pixies if you like, but I don't think we're gonna do that. Just gonna go pixie bounty hunter. Um, or I mean, even though we have goat, but uh, faster thinning is gonna be helpful, and it's also gonna help us hit five. Or like maybe a falconer or stables. Could also be a sacrifice. No, oh, it goes for the for the bounty hunter. And we're gonna do the same, I think. Um, here we're just gonna get double pixie, I think. Um, so we want some city quarters later, I think. Um, well, because it's village here and also good draw. What's the payload gonna be? Silver's gained from Mayfarers maybe. Could also be using some stables for draw. Let's see what his first um, five is gonna be. Oh, he disconnected already. Why well, he was thinking a bit there. Oh, well, this could also be like Pixie Wayfarer for him, right? He's got the, and actually we can do that as well. We want to. Don't have a village yet, but can get one. Yeah, I think the Wayfarer is nice. All right. Doesn't take the boon. He wants his uh, goat back in the shuffle. Um, let's see what boon we will be presented with. Hmm. Maybe black cats could be kinda annoying here. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> We're gonna hit five here, right? Um, which could be stables, could be royal carriage. 
uh, to get an action. Not stable is also fine. I do like Falconer uh, just in general, but I don't know that we wanted us as our first five here. Because there isn't too much stuff going on for it. It just gets a pixie, okay. Uh, we keep that. Don't wanna trigger. Um, let's get the stables. Field's gift. Earth's gift. Maybe he's gonna take that. Four. Could be pixie wayfarer. Yeah, he's gonna take it. Pixie and I don't know if he wants a second wayfarer yet because doesn't have a village. Oh, that might be fine. No, it just takes two pixies, alright. And now a second wayfarer. And city quarter, alright. Um sure let's take that. What's down there? Like Pixie, Bounty Hunter, Stables. Um, I think we're just gonna mouse this. We don't wanna draw the stuff dead. Oh, <laughs> we do anyway, because, well, we got a card. Alright, um, two more pixies. Could also be... Because we can top deck stuff, right? Could be pixies city quarter maybe, top decking. We can't. Alright, while well, this is in play. Okay, so the top decking doesn't actually work. Oh, that's a bit sad. Mm, do we want the city quarter anyway? Not right now, I think. Um, I think we're pretty likely to hit the yeah the the plus buy boon now, and this is gonna be good. No. Hmm. I guess we can take these because we're gonna draw them with wayfarer, and the last one is the buy boon. Um, don't gain a silver here. So this could be Wayfarer, Carriage, City Quarter. Um, 
um, could be Falconer, Carriage, City Quarter. Uh, but what's the Falconer gonna gain? As Price are gonna be an issue, I guess, because we're only get gonna get the the forest gift so often. Uh, let's go with Wayfarer carriage. We can even yeah, we've got four buys. I for, forgot. So this could be two carriages even. I don't know what's a falconer. Is it gonna do much for us? Mm, maybe we buy this last pixie, then the wayfarer is a bit cheaper. So we do it like this, Pixie, Mayfara, Royal Carriage, and a City Quarter. Alright, uh, this isn't great. We need, to, we need to draw the City Quarter or a Stables, or we need to get a boon that helps us. Yeah, it's really sad that this top decking with mouse stuff. Oh, he gets the forest right away again. Oh, that's great for him. Um, really sad that the top decking with tracker doesn't work with the mouse tracker. Oh, maybe we're gonna get a boon that helps us. This would have helped us, but now it's gone. Oh, there's the, the the cycling boon, or maybe the action boon. He's got the wisps, which are also nice. Uh, we wouldn't mind getting a bunch of wisps. I guess we can only build so much here because we're pretty buy limited, so uh that's the boon we would have wanted. Uh sad. That's the boon we would have wanted. Well there's still the, the field's gift. Potentially. Or maybe we get lucky and draw a city quarter or the stables and that gets us there. Yeah, so there's only so much building you can do, and then then you double province, I guess. Maybe we maybe we do one day falconer still. It can, for example, gain additional wayfarers. It can get, can gain bounty hunters to exile. More provinces it can gain, sacrifices or even black cats. He gets a he gets a cat, okay. Oh yeah, we we, we need to take this. Alright. Um uh, we keep this. 
Um, what do we want to carriage? Probably one of the wayfarers. Just gonna put this copper away, I guess. And here we gain a silver. Hmm. How much is this? Could also keep the carriage on the mat. We need to hit five, right? And Right now we can't do that if we also want to trash the copper. So let's just carriage. Gain another silver. Here we don't gain. And we get a falconer and a second city quarter. And now we're looking to start provincing. I don't think there's much more building to be done. We can do this trick um, of now because the bounty hunter doesn't have stuff to exile now, but we can exile a silver and gain it back. Uh, gain one and, and discard from our mat. We've got like a significant amount of treasures in our deck now, so maybe we want a second stables before greening. So he takes the Earth's Gift for another Wayfarer, and what else? A sacrifice, okay. He's gonna be, he's gonna have action problems maybe oh gets a field gift but he only has one city quarter so far so he needs to gain another one And you can also use sacrifice to get actions. But you have to sack some stuff for that. Maybe he's fine with one city quarter. We're gonna see. He gets another wisp. That's really nice. It's probably. Is he gonna double? Just gonna double here. Or maybe province and a city quarter. So we're through the boon pile again. So there, there could be the the plus buy boon again. 
city quarter, province. Two city quarters, okay. Okay, now we're gonna do this. Oh, let's play the pixie first. Ah, uh, we're gonna keep that, don't we? We can exile the goat now, we don't need it, right? Maybe we'll get cursed from the cat, but we don't care, I think. So we carriage this bounty hunter. Uh, now we can falconer a wayfarer. How much is this? This is ten. Uh, We should have kept that pixie for later, so we could draw the silver. Because we would like to hit 13 for a stables and a province, I think. Um, maybe we're just gonna go carriage and stables then. And just mouse this wayfarer, see what we get. Okay. Oh, I can count. Oh, oh. Sure, I can. Because the, the, the tracker gave us plus one, so that's why we have eleven. So let's get carriage and stables, and then we're set for greening. Uh, unless this happens, of course. Yeah, nothing's gonna save us here. Yeah, that's really bad. That's really bad. Maybe we can at least single province, but we need it to double here. Oh, we need to hope that he does as well, I guess. I mean, we did see, just saw the fields gift, right? That would have been an out, like, mouse the wayfarer, get fields gift, and then carriage it to play it. Uh, but that's not gonna be an option now. Maybe you just, I mean, 
we have five silvers, right? So it's probably not that likely that we find eight. We could also just put the carriage down, mouse the wayfarer and buy a duchy. He's certainly gonna double now, I think. Well, I mean, oh, sorry, my my cat opened the the console thing. Um, another wisp. That's really nice. Yeah, he's gonna double now. He has it exact. And. Shouldn't be that likely to that, I think. Well, I mean, this this can happen to him as well, right? This hand. Our decks are not that different in that regard. Still got the goat. Um, maybe he's keeping it for potential black cat curses. Okay, so one province for him. Should be just the second one, yeah. Okay, so what do we want to do here? We can try to find single province. I guess we do. Dutchie isn't gonna cut it, is it? Single province probably. It's not cut it either, but oh, what can you do? Oh, we did find it, okay. So here's our stuff. Alright, so let's see. Oh, he's not gonna dot this turn, is he? Might still. If he didn't find a village. Yeah, okay. That's really good news for us, but... And he didn't even get a province, so that's really, really good for us. Earth Flames... So... What did he gain? A carriage? Uh, sure, let's play this falconer for... I guess a bounty hunter. We wanna get those provinces out of our deck. Ah, oh, that's really good for us. Okay, and I think the plus buy boon should be, still be in there. I think it should. Um, so what do we want to carriage here? Maybe the pixie. Um, so if we double here, we are up to 19. Um, if he then doubles, he's up to 27, which we can beat by province. Um, 
province duchy, not just province duchy, right? Um, so all good. We only need to hit double here, and we also have the Falconer for additional gains. But he might have his cat and give us a curse, but we can then potentially carriage Falconer for gains. Um, so let's just leave the carriages out of our deck. Um, how much? How much money do we need? We don't even need to add that much, right? Because the bounty hunter is gonna give us three dollars both. Um, we have eleven in our deck. Um, which will be 9 if we exile silvers. We exile a silver. We need to gain one back, but we don't need to discard from exile. Oh. Do we want to take that our goal is to double right which we can do um so what's what's this gonna give us He's not gonna get this boon, which is the best news for us, I think. Well, he could still get there. Like, what would we buy? Double province, duchy, that's... I don't think that's worth it. Um, right, we, we get to 19, he's... I miscounted, so double puts us at 19, he doubles, he's at 25, so yeah, we don't need this, we just keep the pixie, we only want to double, and we're good, like, what can he do, right? Um, we don't even need to gain a silver, do we? This is uh, 10, 11. Oh, we do, we do, we do. Um, what's on top, anyway? We did, we did have... We just have five silvers and the pouch. There's a wayfarer on top, okay. Um, so this is 10, 11. With another silver, it's gonna be 13. And we can just... We could just mouse some stuff. Uh, let's get the silver back. We don't want to mouse too much to not get him back to the forest's gift, I think. Somehow I can count to there, right? This is... This is like... Yeah... Ah... Uh, that was not great, so... Because now we have these useless silvers in our deck. Four silvers is eight. So we only needed to mouse like once. 
didn't need all those servers. Oh, that's so bad. That's so bad. Oh, unfortunately, we find the stables. Yeah, so if we did it here, that would have been self-inflicted and deserved. I should have kept those silvers out of the deck and just moused one of our cards to hit exactly 16 and we hit 19, which is way too much. And we didn't even take the, the pixie, so this could have been just double province stables, right? So, yeah, not a fan of that. Uh, what's he gonna do here? Uh, does he have a lot of choice? If he goes like province, duchy, not, he can't do that, we just double we win, double duchy, uh, also not enough. And he's gonna need to hope for the, for the forest gift. Uh, so maybe double duchy and hope for the forest's gift is his best bet. Could be an out for him. Which I guess we don't wanna uh, touch the boon pile for that reason, so he doesn't get closer there. Um, on the other hand, he would also need to make twenty dollars, but I guess he can. I guess he can. Oh, this is nice. What's the last one? Okay, Moon's Gift. Hmm. Should we just mouse through the Boon's pile and try to get there? Yeah, I think at this stage we probably should. There's nine boons left. Chances are we're gonna flip. We're gonna flip the the forest gift. Oh, there's also other boons that would help, right? Like the the Earth's Gift, which could gain two estates. So he's got some outs on his turn. Of course, if we get the Forest's Gift, we're probably just gonna triple. Um, well, maybe not, because we... 
it's gonna be hard to make the money, I think. Unless we get it like right now, uh, like with the first, like with the pixie we play. Oh, 20 bucks. <laughs> Only two buys. Sad. Or is it just gonna play for the dot? I don't think it's the best thing for him to do. Double dot, she seems better. Because he has these, these boon odds. Now, oh, if we flip through the pile and don't find the, the forest's gift, then that's pretty bad for us. Just one dodgy isn't gonna be enough, I think. Then we can comfortably... Then I would think we can comfortably double Oh, he, I guess he just disconnected in the middle of buying it. I would expect another duchy, yeah. Okay. Oh, I need to carry it here. Alright, let's play this pixie first. Nope, keep that. So last turn we hit 19, which means we have 13 money in our deck. Also, the forest gift is best if you can hit it with Pixie. Um, maybe we should have carriage the Pixie, uh, because then you get it twice. So, we can flip like four boons. Um, what do we do? So if we double, we're up 12 points. If you got this black cat, we're only gonna be up 11 points. 12 points, he would need province, two duchies, and an estate. Um, which is four buys. Um, 11 points, he would only need province double duchy. But we can then gain an estate with falcon. Falconer, which is not great, but um, he's certainly gonna bounty hunter the provinces, I think. So we're fifty fifty to to get the the forest gift right. If we don't get it, he will get it for sure. But if he doesn't get it with a pixie, it would, will probably not be enough. 
Okay, let's play this CD quarter first. So this is 13. Mousing will be enough to hit province. Um, let's play Wayfarers first. Uh, let's mouse them. Okay, so this one is gone. We don't want to use it. Alright, there it is. Okay. Now, can we actually make enough for Triple Province? I think we can. We have, right now, we have um, 12, 13, 16. So we carriage for a silver. We will have 18 Wayfarer for. We can do the Bounty Hunter trick again. We will have 21 Wayfarer for another silver. 23 falconer for silver and that should be it right okay Yeah, screw it up. No. Eight silvers. Eight times two, that's sixteen. So we've got um, twenty-three here. We can just bounty hunter the falconer. All right. Okay, we got there. Nice. And on his start as well, which is extra good. Need to roll a new kingdom now. This will be our start. Alright, um, we've got the pixie again. Um, we've got patron. Well, what's our mouse again? Nice. Mouse as the ballop, which is pretty good with rats. Pretty good, actually, because you can just play your rats as develop and they get rid of themselves. Oh. There isn't any draw. Is Coven be any good here? Uh, is Coven gonna be any good here? I wonder. Uh, you can develop into Coven, I guess. So I think we're gonna open rats for sure. No bounty hunter here. I mean, we've also got gold, right? But yeah, I think you can get like fast covens and then um, um, play them. Real fast. Let's try that. Rats and a pixie. So 
So maybe he has a 5-2, but if he does, then the goat in, is in the 5 hand, which wouldn't be great. Um, because either he only gets to trash a copper or he doesn't trash at all and buys a 5, which I don't know that you need like Covenor displays immediately. Yeah, there isn't any draw, so well, apart from the occasional pixie. Alright, so he did have the, the 5 tool. He goes for the bounty hunter, okay. Um, sure, let's get through this shuffle. Um, get to our goat. And maybe a fishing village now, so we can maybe uh, develop rats. Yeah, like this. How's this when you trash this one card? So I think the draw happens before the top decking, I would guess. Um, yeah, all right. We're just gonna top deck Carbon Fishing Village here. And maybe we even rebuy the rats. Um, what else is there to get on four? Oh, it could be another pixie. Eh. Now oh, let's rebuy the rats. And here, here we could banish three coppers. Yeah, that sounds good. Then we're really thin and can do this developing stuff again. Yeah, right. Um. This time we don't want a fishing village on top, but a stockpile, I think. Well, maybe, maybe we actually play this rats because we don't want to re have to rebuy it. Uh, we'd like to have more rats in our deck. Okay, now he goes for the rats as well. Just see if we can get to our coven. No, we can't. But it's fine. Now we're clean. Um, let's get Pixie here. All right, we're gonna take this. Um. I guess we develop again. Uh, 
and here a gold I think oh maybe just another coven we wanna now shower him in curses might have to trash a stockpile here but um you wouldn't mind would like to get rid of our goat at some point and reds are also gonna be useful once these curses come in but the curse split should be really in our favor I think because it's already 3 to 1 soon to be at least 5 to 1 And later we can develop rats into this place, I guess. And then just green. Um, I guess we get rid of the fishing village over the stockpile. Oh, uh, maybe not. We might want to non-terminally develop. What do we want to buy anyway? If we trash the stockpile, that would be nine. If we trash the fishing village, it would be eleven. Now we want to play the covens as often as possible, right? So um, let's trash the fishing village, use this, these stockpiles to buy like pixies and a coven. Could be two pixies in the coven. Okay, so the curse split is gonna be 8 to 2, and uh, that sounds pretty good for us. Um, just gonna play these and not do anything here. Um, now we can buy a gold. Uh, he doesn't have the curses in his deck yet, but they will come. We now have the curses in our deck. Yeah, 8 to 2, that's a really good outcome for us. Um, let's play one of these. Keep this. Keep this. Uh, we displace this rats into stockpile this place. Now we just green. There are two curses in there, so we play this rats and hope to draw one.
now we're just gonna green. Or uh, maybe there's even a pile out on like carbon stockpiles. Could it be? Probably not on this turn. Well, depending on what he buys, anyway. That's your pixie, okay. Um, let's play this rats and try to find one of these curses. Nope. We found a coven. Uh, that's a bit sad. Uh, we trash a coven. I think. There's two curses on top, so we would really like to have a rats down there. Like we could just place Coven into gold rats. Um and by this place I mean mouse. Should this be a duchy? Or just a displace. Um, is he gonna pile on us? That seems really hard. Oh, I mean, with two rats in hand, maybe you can do like displace twice. Common stockpile, common stockpile. Can he do that and also win? I don't think he can. Let's just get a duchy anyway and not worry about it. Okay, there's the two curses. And just a duchy here. Oh no, no, we regret having this duchy here, right? Now we wish it would be a gold. Uh, there should be like gold displays down there or something, I think. We didn't trash any curses so far, so I think we're good. We're just gonna touch you here, I think. Okay. Can we win? I think we can, right? Carbon rats into carbon stockpile. Displace gold into carbon by the stockpile. Um. Uh. 
Okay. So, played a bit unnecessarily scared there. Um, with the duchy by, but we won anyway, so I'll take it. Okay, so now we need to get one more tie, basically, and we win the thing, so let's see if we can do it here. Oh, there's C's today. Okay. Play of the Owl. There's. There isn't any trashing here. Um, guess it draw the Shepherd. And. They're nice. Well, pasture is nice for court here, right? Um, so, could open Haven Shepherd. Haven seems nice to me with Shepherd. Uh, is there anything better? I don't think there is. And do you want Coven here? We're gonna see. If the curses come into your deck, it's gonna be really bad. Of course there's Moat and you could just stuff Moats in, into your deck, but then you have Moats. But... Maybe you can manage because you have coin of the realm and it might even help with, sh with shepherds. Okay, this is really nice. Um, gonna set aside the pasture and Uh, maybe do we want to set the pasture aside really? Because then this courtier courtier that we want to buy could be sad. Of course we might also just redraw the shepherd and then we're sad. Uh maybe we set the copper aside. <laughs> okay, there's the courtier, but we got the pasture anyway, so it all didn't matter. Um, buy coins gold. One gold is fine, but we don't want to be over overdoing them. Um, Shepherd Haven, I think. Okay, Shepherd misses, but um, it's fine. So another Shepherd or a Market Square. Um, an additional additional buy is nice, right? Because there's peddlers, so let's get a Market Square here. Okay, so he goes for the Coven. Which well, isn't great. Which I think means we want to get some modes. Well, maybe we don't need them right now, but just a bit later, just to um, prevent these curses coming into our deck. Let's get another. Market square here. Hmm. 
Mm. This shuffle has been really bad. We saw both shepherds already, so this next turn it's not gonna be great either. It's gonna have two havens in the market square. If he gets second coven here, no, he doesn't. Okay. I mean. Oh, he does. Okay, now we add a, add a mode. And we don't want another gold, I think. So we go... Mode, coin of the realm. Coins are also nice with havens, because you can use way of the owl. Way of the owl. We're just gonna be stuffing modes into our deck now. Um, so that the curses hopefully never come. Uh, yeah, I think we're gonna trigger this because Okay, here's the mode, which is nice, because I do think he's going to be playing a carbon. Nope. Uh, let's hope we can find a shepherd here. Uh, that would be great, actually. No. In which case we're gonna get... Oh. Let's play this mode as all. Or... Not just regularly even, because this next hand isn't gonna be great. Um, we want more buys. So market square. Peddler. It could just be more modes and coins. Or maybe we're overdoing it a bit then. So these shepherds are down there and they're not gonna find anything. So maybe we just add a shepherd here. Yeah. And these shepherds have been really rough. Um, hiding at the top, hiding with all the states. Hiding at the bottom with all the states. That's not gonna cut it. He just provinces here. Right here we have a mode. Um, but it's not going to do anything. Okay. Here we can all this mode. We're gonna be calling the coin anyway, right? So, well, let's do action by. There's another mode down there that we might want to play. These shepherds aren't really behaving. Uh, 
Or at least he set an estate aside for them. Uh, how can we build more market square mode coin? Okay, there's a mode. That's what we needed. I think the idea behind this deck we built was fine, but um, these two shuffles were the, where our both our shepherds didn't find anything. They didn't really help. Uh, in fact, they were really bad. Um, now he's just gonna run away on provinces, I think. And he got all the peddlers too. So let's play this mode first. Uh, need to play another one, I think. Uh, this one we don't want to play. Um. I think we really want to add some more green cards to our deck. Uh, because these shepherds aren't doing a whole lot. Could be like... Dutchy mode haven. This this game is a lost cause probably. The idea was not to play with covens but with better stuff, but um, maybe that idea is misguided because we need to buy all this stuff to defend and he doesn't. Um, I mean maybe if the early game goes different we can also add our own covens, but didn't really go our way. Let's set the statue aside. There's a shepherd down there. Ah, this is not gonna work at all. Well, 
that's fine. I mean, even if you don't do this mode stuff the way um, our shepherds didn't cooperate, um, I think we were pretty lost anyway, even if we add our own covens. Because these, these shuffles in the mid game were just so bad, they were so slow. Eventually these curses will come into our deck. Um... There's two shepherds down there, right? No. Well, there, there, there was one, right? But we didn't find it. Which would have been good this hand. Oh, at least we're doing a decent job of finding our modes. Uh, let's play it first. Okay, now we found some green. Now we found some green cards. Uh, let's play one of them. Um, let's action coin here. Alright, this is more like I imagined this thing to be. And now we're finding the shepherds and the, the moat at the top of our stuff. There's also seize the day, so there's an upper opportunity. We might need to go for that. If he doesn't do it before us, oh, he misses eight. Maybe there is a chance of a lucky seize. I think we might try that here. Oh, maybe he's gonna seize now. I mean, he's still 16 points ahead, maybe more after this. Uh, we can make that. We can make that up. Potentially. Yeah, he sees us, okay. Well, if this turn doesn't do anything, it didn't, okay. Well, he gets two estates. So we might just province seize. All right, let's see if we can do this. Play the mode first. Another mode. Okay, we find some green. Find some more green. Um, action coins gold, I think.
Let's say shepherd on top. And what else? How much money is this? This is 10, 14. Um, well, I mean, how much do we even need to make? Um, we need three provinces and a duchy. Which means on the C's turn we would need to make 21. I don't think that's realistic. So maybe we need to... Province. How much do we have? 16 or 8? There's a copper on top. We could have done this better uh, if we didn't play the haven right now. But the two modes and then we can set it up so there's a lot of green on top. Uh, that wasn't ideal. Um, 14 could be... Province, Shepherd, Haven. Could be two duchies and seas. Two duchies and seas, that's... We need 20 points, so two duchies don't really help with that. Because we then still need two provinces and a duchy. Okay, let's get Province Shepherd Haven and hope that he does. We can't seize here, can we? Actually, do we want to play on here? I mean, there's Shepherd and a Copper. And what else? I think a green card. Uh, which, if that's the case, we leave it there. We need him to that again. Yeah, it was an estate. Okay, what do we need now? Two provinces, two duchies. Maybe we can set it up now for our C's turn. Uh, gonna play this mode. Um, we wanna play this Haven yet. How much money is in our deck? There's the coin, seven coppers. No, seven, so eight, fourteen, seventeen, which is enough, which is exactly enough for province that she sees. Um, so I don't think we want to set aside a copper. Could set aside a haven, maybe. Well, 
Well, is there another way? What's three duchies and a province? That's 15. That's not enough. I don't think we want to discard the pasture. Um, we won't get back around to it. We have a peddler. Okay, so we can make 17. There's also a shepherd in there, so we can top deck green. Uh, we need... So let's count again. We need two provinces, two duchies. So we get province, duchy, seas here, and province, duchy on the next turn. And we do that. We do have four shepherds, right? We have one, two, three, four. Okay, so there's one down there. Um, so now we trigger. There's the pasture, alright. We can get a bit more into this green stuff. Um, so this is 7, 13, 14, 15, 18, okay. We counted correctly. And I don't even think we want a gold. Because we only need to hit province duchy again. Wait a minute, did I miscount? Province, province, and two duchies. That's 40 plus 6. No, that's, that's alright. So we don't want a gold, I think. So action, well, action by coins here. Um, Need to find a shepherd now. Oh, if we can't find it, I'll be so sad. Oh my god. Oh, we almost got there. Oh well. It could have been. Oh man. That's so sad. It's just, oh, uh, well, I mean, we got another one. We got another one to, to win it, but, oh, uh, that hurts a bit because this one felt so lost and then we got a chance, but we couldn't find the shepherd. Unfortunately. All right. Oh, well, let's, let's not beat ourselves up over it. And just try to win the next one, which will be on our start. Um, okay. 
And this is some of the last stuff with Magpie. Um, way of the author as well. I mean, what's payload gonna be? Just money. I think we're just gonna open Magpie Silver. Try to buy a sanctuary. Um, do we want to play with Goat Herd? I think just sanctuaries. We want to play with Shepherd Draw, I don't think so. Here we'll get a Devil's Workshop because imps are nice. Well, I guess the duchy buy last game was wrong because we could have still caught up with province duchy against his duchy buy, but let's not think about that game right now. But let's think about the game at hand. So if there's we hit five here, right? There's a state on top, we hit it. If there's copper on top, we hit it as well. And we get a second sanctuary here. Now let's hope to pair up our magpie and devil's workshop. The best thing for magpie to reveal is pasture because you draw it. Um, and you also gain a magpie. Alright, here you're just gonna gain a gold. And another magpie here. Could be two more even. Maybe you should play with Shepherds. Um, maybe we should. So what's this five cost gonna be? What's this five gonna be? Don't think we need another sanctuary. Could just be more magpie.
and this is cool. Um, this is actually a really cool trick. We wanna be doing that too. We definitely wanna be doing that. Yeah. For sure. Uh, how did the magpie split went? How did it go? Five to five. All right. Uh, don't exile here. We wanna be doing this too. Put some on top a magpie and okay now the magpie is on top all right. Um, so this could be gold. Gain an imp. Payload's gonna be money, right? Oh, there wasn't a magpie on top. Um, so the magpie split is 6-4. I miscounted that. Um, that I don't like. Okay, he's gonna be doing more of these auto villas. He's got one magpie in hand, right? Okay. Okay, we're gonna be doing auto villa here as well. Auto this. And what's this? Uh, I think another auto villa. We wanna get to our devil's workshop. Alright. So we saw one, two, three, four. I think there's there's an imp on top. Which means you don't wanna exile the copper, I think. You wanna just buy a gold. I mean the 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 villa otter trick is nice, but um I don't think you wanna be overdoing it because then you have all these villas in your deck. Which don't do a whole lot. So we have a lot more money in our deck than he does, and that I like. I think we're ready to start greening. And we can add in a shepherd. To help with the draw. If the shepherd doesn't find um, a green card, we can utter it. Buys an estate, which indicates that he wants to get a shepherd. Well, I would think at least that it indicates that. All right. Um, I 
let's play the sanctuary regularly all right we do the the villa otter again and let's get rid of these coppers Would be nice to have one more, one more coin. What's on top? Uh, we saw one, two, magpie. I think there's magpie and copper on top. We can just province silver, gain an imp. We would really like to add a shepherd, right? Because this magpie draw is gonna carry us all the way through. I mean, he's got the magpie split 6 4, but he doesn't have that much treasure in his deck. So there's not a lot for the birds to draw. How much money do we have in our deck? Played two golds, three golds. We have three golds. We have two silvers. We have pasture. That's 14. And we have what, copper. That's 15. And some villa plays potentially. Maybe we don't need the shepherd because we can just exile the green. Um, what's he gonna do here? Just the gold, maybe. for more villas okay I don't know about that because they're just well once they're in deck there are they aren't as nice anymore uh, 
Maybe he's looking to pile the states or something. That's a lot of points, but also expensive, and he won't be able to play all the villas for a buy. Plus, he won't be able to draw your deck. At least, I don't think that he will be able to. But maybe you can with Imp and Otter. Maybe you can. Um, I don't think he can make enough money. Is there what's on top of this deck? Um, well, it's either a Devil's Workshop or something else. Could be an Imp. More villas. Okay. Copper. That's really interesting to me. Right on. He's got to have something counted out. Like that makes me think he wants to go for the estates and needs like one more dollar. To do it. How much money is in his deck? That's six, eight, um, twelve, thirteen. With the copper, it's fourteen. Fourteen is yeah, seven times two. So he wants to go for the est estates, but and that's gonna be fourteen points, which which is gonna beat us if we just province. I even oh, what? Okay, that seems a bit crazy to me. I mean, are you gonna be able to draw it all? But well, well, we'll see. Maybe he feels like he needs to go for that gamble. Even more coppers. Wow. Um. Huh. This isn't great. Do we want to exile this? I don't do you think we want to. Okay, there's a villa on top. And maybe B can take some of these estates. And then what's he gonna do? This we're gonna auto, I think. Seven estates is fourteen, that's twenty-two. If he just province Dutchy, he'll be at twenty-one, so he can beat that. Um, what's down there? More gold. If we buy what's five estates? Five estates. We need ten dollars, which we have. Um, so if we just buy five estates, what does he do?
what's on top here there's a gold a silver and devil's workshop and a copper maybe I think we want to draw here a province as well. Okay. Yeah, that's silver and doubles workshop. But we can just double and we're fine. So let's just do that. We could also double shepherd and two estates. That would put us at, uh, I mean, province, shepherd, two estates. We could also shepherd shepherd and four estates. Then we're at twenty. Well, he could beat that by province. Four estates were at twenty. And he can then get three estates, he's at 14, can get a province. Uh, which would tie him up. Hmm. Would really like to get a shepherd. Um. Let's say we get Shepherd for Estates. Nah, I don't like it. It's just double province that only puts two green cards in our deck. And I doubt his deck is gonna function anyway. Yeah, like this. Um, it just destroyed his deck with all these coppers, so there's no need for us to do anything fancy. Um, do we wanna auto this magpie? I don't think so. Okay, nice, we got the... So here we can just, um, we've got seven, right? We can just Dutchy Estate if we want to. Puts us at 29. And an M. Now he's probably got enough to empty estates, which is 12, 23, and then, yeah, but that doesn't win. Again, that duchy wasn't necessary, should have been a shepherd, I think. Province, Shepherd, maybe? Poacher, okay. Let's imp this magpie. Villa, Otter. Sanctuary, this. And you can just Province, 
a good shepherd. Shepherd and two estates. That uh, puts us at 33. You can then get eight estate, uh, four estates for eight, that's 25. And we would still need province and duchy, which is 19. How much money did he make there? 12. Uh, because we wanted a shepherd in our deck and this is a really great starting hand I think he just destroyed his deck with all these coppers. That, that was really unnecessary, I think. Um, all right, this should be it. Um, and, and, um, you can just empty estates now. Okay. All right. Nice. Uh, we did it in the end. Um, okay. Cool. So we did manage to win the, win the menagerie mix. Last two games a bit shaky, but we'll take it. Um, all right, so thank you everybody for watching and listening. Um, this mix was really fun to play thanks to the organizers, to Donald X who curated it, and I'll see you, um, see everybody in league and other stuff. Goodbye.